derivative of y equals a cosine bx minus c, which is our uh, standard cosine curve. And a, b, and c are all constants. So a is a multiplicative constant. It will end up in our derivative. Now we do have a chain rule going on here because we're taking the derivative of more than just x. So cosines are outside function. Derivative of cosine is negative sine. We leave the inside alone. So it stays as bx minus c. And then we have to multiply by the derivative of the inside. The inside is bx minus c. Derivative of bx is just b. Derivative of c by itself, it's a constant by itself, so it's zero. So putting this all together, we have a negative a b sine of bx minus c for our derivative.